heard screaming coming through the third, third floor. I tried to make entry. The whole first floor was engulfed in flames. No hesitation. A brave Philadelphia police officer jumps into action at the site of flames. How he managed to save lives in North Philadelphia. And we've learned this isn't the first time the quick thinking officer helped remove others from danger. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Jim Donovan. And I'm Rahul Solomon. I'm News reporter Jan Carabeo. Talk to the officer who happened to be in the right place at the right time. Signs of a fast moving fire on the 1500 block of Oxford Street in North Philadelphia. A row home split into apartments is now ruined. But hours before, the concern was much greater. Six people live here, including an eight year old girl, and they needed to get out. I just heard somebody screaming, and once I looked at the sidewalk, it was like uh, mattresses on fire. So I just ran downstairs with like a bucket of water, and I seen the cops outside. On patrol Friday morning, 10 year veteran Philly police officer Eric Steese was one of the first on the scene. He spotted that fire as it started to spread from the first floor and did not hesitate. I got a fire extinguisher. I put out the mattress the best I can. That, that did little, though, but we had to take immediate action right away to get everybody out. He and five other Philly cops rushed to the rescue. And the back wasn't on fire, so that was the easiest way when none of us get hurt. Went to the second floor, climbed on the rooftop, and we were able to get him off the roof and back on ground level, and they were treated with their uh, minor injuries. Now, with the help of Philly Fire, everyone got out. Three people were taken to the hospital for treatment, one of them with burns, but all are expected to recover. Thanks to Philly's bravest, and this time it's finest too. So two weeks ago, we drove in on another fire, same thing, made entry, and this one was pretty bad. I guess this goes down for the books. The fire marshal says this was an accidental fire. The exact cause is still under investigation. In North Philadelphia, Jan Carabello, CBS3 Eyewitness News.